Okay, a bit of a milestone today as this is the last, could be potentially the last time the family is on the field like this. Johnny, the oldest of the, the youngest of the uh, Trevian, uh, the youngest of the Rosinski family. Playing for his older brother against their father. Father coaches at Lembrook South, Brian. I remember the days when Brian played. Played pretty good uh, both football and baseball. Out in uh, center. And they're right, Johnny Rowe. I missed the first two. It was uh, Franklin at. Uh, in center, uh, Lashman, Gardner, Murphy, and Dominic. And on the infield, battery Paul Duncan and TJ O'Donnell. That's pitch low, a ball, and uh, Jim Hall out in uh, left field today. The pitch on the way, high pump up. Dan Silvato. And called for it is Dominic. Takes it for the out. Quickly went up, one down. It's a strike. Mike Kerr, the batter. That's a high pop-up on the infield. Gardner calling for it. And takes it for the out. Quickly, two up, two down. Here's T.J. McManus. Strike, strike one. McManus. I think somebody changed pens here. I just realized something. That's not the best pen to use. Doing the scores. A little foul tip, strike. Just realize that. Wrong pen. And strike three. One, two, three. And out. And we go to the bottom half of the first inning. Here at New Trier, Jim Hall leads it off. And a ball. Sunshiny day again. Uh, like the last time these two teams met, a little bit of a wind blowing in. That's blowing outside the ball. There's a line shot. Knocked down. Nope. And an error. And here's Murphy. Strike, uh, stolen base for Jim Hall. So runner at second. That's a ball low and outside. On the mound is Eric Gilderman. the ball two, 
Two balls, one strike. A little bunt, and it's a beauty. Going to do the job. Score that is a sacrifice. Here's Mike Dominic. Again, the infield pulled in for the Titans, looking for a play at the plate. Trevian's perfect on the Central Suburban South season. There's a strike. Currently with a record of 13 and four. A couple of big games coming up. There's a bunt. They're gonna take it home. The throw, they got him. I'll score that as a fielder's choice. Is Johnny Rowe, Johnny Wojcinski. Ball ball back to the screen. Straight down. Will foul tip, strike two. Not keeping his head on the ball very well. Johnny's struggling a little bit this spring. That flow ball. So three. And the inning over. Neither team scored here in the first inning at the end of one. Obviously, that means we've got no score. Here on the Metro Chicago Sports Network. We'll be back. And we go to the second inning. Jeff Grodecki, the banner. There's a strike. Bright, sunshiny day. Wind blowing in, though. Uh, the pitch on the way on the outside corner for a strike. Ducking into the windup, the pitch, high bounder. Taken by Gardner over to first in time. 6 3 on the put out. Here's Todd Whitehead. Whitehead. The batter. The batter. Number five in the batting order. There's a strike. Left-hander Paul Duncan on the mound. Trevians won the first game, ten nothing. Little foul tip. Now the pitch on the way. Strike three. Caught him on the inside corner. A little ground ball. Bounces up for Gardner. Over to first. In time. Three on the put out and the inning over. Another one, two, three. No runs, no hits, no errors. Nobody left. Move along to the bottom half of the frame. The second inning. And leading it off is Chris Lashmet. So Chris Lashmet, the tall Ranger third baseman for the Trevians. Batting in the number five position. The 
Millick and the pitch on the way. Fouled off. Strike one. That's all ball. One and one to Lashmit. Chris says hit the ball well on the last week. That side of ball. Quickly into the delivery. Ground ball. High bounder. Third baseman has it. I don't know what a first five three on a put out. And there's one away. And the ball outside. Dale Huck, the batter. There's a strike. There's a high fly ball down the line. It's going to go foul. Outfield playing pretty much straight away. That's the ball. And another ball. Shoot through the screen. That's what you get sometimes. Deuces on the count. There's a strike. Whoa. Wait a minute. <laughs> Where are you going, Dale? There's a strike. Yeah, he was out. On the strikeout, he thought it was a walk. Franklin, the batter. Low and outside of all. Second inning, no score. Another quick ball game today. No foul ball. There's a soft liner, base hit. And Franklin on his way to second, and he'll make it. There's a strike. T.J. O'Donnell. First hit of the ball game for either team. Ball gets away, but nobody going anywhere. Ball ball back. Yeah, slow roller. Third baseman has it. Throws over to first in time and the inning over. No runs, one hit, no errors, one left. As we played through two, no score. Here on the Metro Chicago Sports Network on Comcast. And we go to the third inning. Leading it off is Trevor Stevens. The pitch by Duncan. High and tight. Bottom third of the batting order due up. And a strike. Yeah, the cut was up at one and one. <laughs> Glenbrook South, the defending Central Suburban South champion. There's a leadoff single. So runner aboard. Here's Moylan.
So Moylan bats. Corey Moylan. Stevens aboard at first. Duncan into the windup. Works over that way. The kick and the delivery. High pop up. And that's going to be windshield whacker back behind us. Delivery. High and outside a ball. Beautiful day for baseball. Just such a wonderful afternoon. Foul ball right back to us. Whoa, that'll wake you up. <laughs> Hit the camera, actually. And you saw it. And made a little whoopsie in there. Throw it down there. Runner set. Stolen base. Outside of all. That was strike three, by the way, on Moylan. I've got a wrong number here. That's in the dirt, a ball. The look back. Ball four. Oh, I'm right. Call him. And we got a courtesy runner over there for Cullum, Chris Belansky. A walk, two men on here. There's a high fly ball right at Johnny Rowe to the out. Here's Kerr. Ball gets away, back to the screen. And the runners advance on up. Mike Kerr, the batter. Foul ball. Second away, strike. Reach out for that. Fouled it out of play. Windshield wagon. That's high a ball. We're here at Duke Childs Field. And for Wilbur Duke Childs, the first athletic director at New Trier. He was there, oh, just about 40 years. High and outside of all. Strike three in the inning. No runs on one hit. A walk and two left. We move to the bottom half 
of the third inning, and we still have no score. Hello there, little one. It's coming to the coming into the ball game. They're the members of the True Blue Trevian crew here today. Here's Gardner to lead it off. That's a ball. To Ben Gardner, the ninth batter in the lineup. Batting in the number nine spot, as it were. That's a pitch low ball. Two and out. Well, I like it. Both these pitchers like to work fast. There's a strike. And the count goes to two and one. To Ben Gardner. That's a low ball. And a strike, and the count goes full. The Gardner. Strike three. Uh, each team, no runs with one hit. That's high and tight a ball. Here's leadoff man Jim Hall. He was safe on an error last time up. Got fisted. Back to the screen. Strike. And hit by a pitch. Yeah. Doing the job of a leadoff man. Here's Mac Murphy. Murphy sacrificed a runner over to third last time. Throw over to first. And haul back. There goes the runner. There's a strike. There's the throw. Not in time. Stolen base. Here's Mac Murphy. Batting with a runner at second now. Little squibber. Tough chance. Oh, no, no one's going to get to that one. And score that as an infield single. Would have been a tough chance anyway. So, runners up the corners with one out. And here's Mike Dominic. And straight. Dominic safe on a fielder's choice. His first time up. Hall thrown out at the plate. Now the pitch. Inside a ball. Bottom of the third inning. No score. Throw over the first runner back. There's a high bounder, shortstop, and only play will be the first. And on the play, coming home to score is Hall. 6-3 on the put out. And here's Johnny Rowe. And it's one nothing neutral. There's a strike, strike one. Rosinski struck out his last time up. Two out. Runner on at second. There's a strike. And a foul tip. Hell on for strike three. In the inning, no, one run on one hit, 
and one left. At the end of three, it's one nothing New Trier over Glenbrook South. We'll be back with more. That was a next generation of Rosinski. Of Rosinski's daughter Carrie. And Brian Rosinski's daughter Carrie and the two grandkids. Here's TJ McManus. Carrie, pretty darn good basketball playing in her time. There's a strike at the letters. There's a pretty good basketball team that she was on. Now the pitch on the way. High fly ball, shallow. And Murphy takes it for the out. One up, one down. Here's Gradecki. The pitch. There's a bunt. Foul. Strike. We're in the fourth. Trevians, one run on two hits. The Glamour South Titans, no runs on one hit. And they've committed one error. There's a line shot. That's on the giddy up and not going to get to that one. And bounces over the fence for a ground rule double. So a double. Here's uh, Whithead. Outside a ball. Might have been a little bit low too. Runner fakes to go, swing, ground ball. Picked up the long throw, right on the money. Two down. Here's Tom Janke. There's a strike. The Janke, runner on at second. Into the windup. And the pitch. That's a strike. Swing a ground ball. Slow roller. Picked up. The throw. In time. Four, three. It looked a little late to me, but in the inning, no runs, one hit. No errors. One left. Go to the bottom half of the frame. Lashmitt, Hoff, and Franklin do up. Beautiful sunshiny day. Wind blowing in. There's Chris Lashman. And a foul ball. That's in the dirt of ball. Already just passed halfway home. That's a little ball. In there for a strike. Deuces on the count. And the pitch. Bounder foul. Shave and a haircut. Two bits. And it kind of goes full. 
to Chris Slashman. Ball four. And Chris aboard. Here's Dale Huff. Out of first, runner back. The first walk issued today by Gelderman. Gets a sign from Cullum. Throw over to first. Flashman back. Dale Huff the batter. Sam Franklin on deck. Abby delivery. In there for a strike. Get the letters inside half. Throw over to first. Then again, the runner back in plenty of time. Time called. And Huff steps out. Now back in, ready to go. There goes the runner, hitting behind him. Ground ball to the first baseman. Steps on the bag. That's a sacrifice. He's trying to go the other way. Advance the runner along. Here's Franklin. Foul ball. At least that's the way I'm going to score it. the ball inside. Time called. As Franklin steps out of the batter's box. Still runner in second. One out. Trevian's trying to go 4-0 in a conference as of right now. Pitch high a ball. You got to now make them kind of the odds-on favorite to win the conference, if that means anything, which it really doesn't. There goes a runner. Strike. There goes the throw down to third. And they say they got him. Caught stealing. There's a line shot base hit by Franklin and Sam Franklin starting to find his batting stroke today. Two for two on the day. And here's T.J. O'Donnell. Throw to first, runner back. And a backdoor front roll through here today. There's a line shot back to the gap. And TJ on his way to third. And here comes the throw. They did not get him. A triple for TJ. And a run home. And it is 2 nothing, Trevian. There's a ball knocked down. Over to first in time. And the inning over, but the Trevians come up with another run. And now lead it 2 to nothing as we go to the fifth. And we'll be back with more here on the Education Channel. This is the Metro Chicago Sports Network. And we go to the fifth inning. Stevens, Moylan, and Cullum, bottom third of the batting order, do up for the Glenberg South Titans. And the pitch, first pitch hitting ground ball. Picked up by Dominic. Over to the pitcher, Duncan covering. 3 1 on the put out. One up, one down. Here's Moylan. He struck out his first time up. One to four by Paul Duncan so far this game. 
inside a ball. And that's inside a ball. Foul ball. Strike. That's a strike out of the outside corner. Deuces on the count. Moylan. Titans have stranded five so far. Outside the ball, and the count goes full at three and two. Three and two. And ball four. Here's Cullum. Kevin Cullum, the catcher for the Titans. Duncan in the lineup, looked over that way, delivers. As a soft liner, knocked down, throw to second, and the fielder's choice. Marlon kind of got caught in no man's land there. That's not an error, not a hit. It's the fielder's choice. Here's Salvato. Go to first. It's a two-way. There's a bunt. That's foul. Polanski again running over at first. The throw over there. Oh, they got him picked off. Go to second in time. And the inning over. No runs, no hits, a walk, and nobody left. We go to the fifth inning. Bottom of the fifth. And leading it off is Jim Hall. One, two, and three in the Trevian batting order do up. Hall, Murphy, and Dominic. Line shot through for the base hit single. And here's Mac Murphy. Go to first. And haul back. Showing bunt. Infielders pull in. And yeah, runner goes to second. Safe, another stolen base. That's his third stolen base of the day. Outside the ball. And the infield moves back a little bit. There goes a runner. And they had that play set. They got him. Oh, my. As I looked at that, it looked like uh, they may have missed him with the tag, but it was close enough. High school ball, that sometimes you look at those plays and they don't really s seem like there's quite as exact as some of the higher levels. It's a ball. And Murphy draws a walk. So with one out, one on, here's Mike Dominic. Here's a strike. Usually the dead giveaway on those as if the on the tag the fielder raises that ball up real high it seems like 
Seems to be some sort of question, was he out or not? There's a strike. So Mike Dominic bats. Trevian's leading 2-0. There's a strike. Strike three. Two away. Here's Johnny Rowe. He struck out twice. I think Johnny getting a little frustrated. Going up there swinging. Pitch out, runner not going, ball. There's the ball, there goes the throw, nope, stolen base. Well, last game, Trevians had eight stolen bases. Bring it to miss, strike. That's when they already have four. Inside a ball. Side, ball four. Second walk of the inning. Issued by Gelderman. And there's Chris Lashman. Takes a strike. And a ball outside. The counting's up at one and one. Originally, the idea, there's a line shot caught by the first base. Well, I'll tell you more about that. In the inning, no runs. One hit, two left via walks. And we move to the sixth. It's 2 nothing. New Trayer. We'll be back with more. Top of the sixth inning. There's a high bounder, tough chance. Throw in time. Nice job by Murphy. Charging the ball, getting there. Get the throw away. Cross body. Mike Kerr takes the ball low and outside. Ball one. I bounder, tough chance. Gardner with it. Throws in time. 6-3 on the put out, two way. Here's McManus. Boy, new troop been playing some great defensive baseball of late. Eye and outside the ball. I mean, they've been playing it all along. Except that first week. It's, I think the first week they kind of had some problems. Let me go back and look here. A tie ball. Uh, no, it is against Loyola. He had three. No, no errors against Naperville Central. Three errors against Carmel. The only clinker. McManus, two out. Oh, Trevian's pitching staff has come around a little bit. Ball four. Third walk issued today by Paul Duncan. The Glenbrook South Titans have managed a grand total of two hits, up four hits in the last uh, 12 and two thirds innings against the Trevians. I could go back and look at last year's, but it'd take me a little while to find that scorebook. That's low ball. Well, not all that long. I know where it is. It's just 
not in this uh, area near me. Ryan outside a ball. Some run around at first, two out. Trevian's two runs on five hits. Another foul ball back to the screen. There's a high fly ball. Back, back, and gone. And this ball game is all tied up. Gradecki with a blast to right field. And we're tied up at two. Whithead the batter. Whithead takes outside for a ball. Ground ball, two for the base hit, single. And here's Danke, but first we're gonna have a little discussion out on the mound. Coach Clip out there, there you see that wind blowing in. It's about the only way you can get it out is to hit it to right. Anything else, that wind's gonna have an effect on. So I got a miss, strike. Here's Janke. Twice he has grounded out. Once to Gardner. And once to Murphy. Throw to first. Again, they had the runner picked off. The throw. They got him. On a slide by. And the Giants, none too happy. Uh, Titans, rather, none too happy about that. In the inning, two runs. On two hits, no errors, and nobody left. So here's Huff to lay it off. Makes a strike, strike one. All tied up. Gradecki, two for three on the day for the Titans. That's in the dirt, a ball. Franklin's two for two on the day. He's due up. He's on the on deck circle. That's a ball. There's a foul ball back to the screen. Deuces on the count. There's a line shot, knocked down. Go to first, one three on the put out, one away. Here's Sam Franklin, a single and a double. There's a ball outside. There's Sam Franklin. Got the first hit of the ball game for the Trevians. Back in the second, a double to the gap out in right center. Outside of all. A ground ball, charging, has it up. Throwing, 5-3 out of put out. I can see players run a little harder up the, up the line on, on ground balls. Might have a chance of beating one of them out. There's a strike on uh, foul tip to T.J. O'Donnell. Hey, 
And a slow ground ball. Third base, uh, second baseman charges, takes it for the out. One, two, three, three up, three down. No runs, no hits, no errors. We go to the seventh inning, and we're all knotted up at deuces. We'll be back with more in just a moment here on the network. Here's Janky. He gets a new chance to bat. He was at bat when Witta was thrown out. That's the third time today Nutrier picked somebody off first base. There's a ground ball. And again, and oh my, he got him. Wow. Great job by Duncan getting over there. 3-1 on the putout. That's the second time today that Duncan's done a great job of getting over. He's got a foul ball back to the screen. Stevens the batter. Seventh inning. Ball game all knotted up. That's high ball. For the Trevians, two runs on five hits. No errors. There's a line drive down the line. Fair ball. Going to second is Stevens. And he'll hold up there with the double. So Stevens a barred at second. And here's Moylan. One out. There's a strike. Yeah, I'm a little upset with that one. Trevians two runs, five hits, no errors. Titans two runs, four hits, one error. There's a high pop-up foul and a wind chill whacker. Back into the parking lot behind us here. Outside the ball. Get the runner to go back. Threatening the throw was T.J. O'Donnell. Deuces on the count, I believe. I think that's how many fingers he held up. That's a ball, and the count goes full. Fly ball, right field, and shallow. Taken by Murphy, tried to catch the runner at second. Throw back there, they got him. Pickoff play, caught napping in the inning. No runs, no hit, uh, one hit, no errors, nobody left. Go to the bottom of the seventh. Leading it off is scheduled to be Gardner. Gardner, Hall, and Murphy do up. Scheduled to bat. Let's put it that way. So Ben Gardner bats. A pitch on the way. Line shot, base hit to right. 
A uh, leadoff man aboard here at the bottom of the seventh. And he's going to take it all the way to second. And out comes the coach. He's going to do a little stretch jedizing. And they're actually going to go with two outfielders. And the short third baseman in close. The ball got away a little bit, but Gardner not going to risk it. There you see what they've got. That's that's really the left fielder. Hall. And then two in the two gaps, left center, right center. There's a bunt down the first baseline. Boy, that's a great play. Over the first, and the sacrifice works to perfection. Wow. That's a great job. Fantastic job done by Jim Hall. Moving that runner along. And runner at third with one out. Representing the game winning. Go home run. There's a straight. Bottom of the seventh. That's a ball. Time called. A little more stretch Jedison going on. Infield pulled in, look for play at the plate. That's a ball. Now they pitch, line shot, that's a base hit. And the run comes home and the ball game all over. Mac Murphy doing the job. We'll be back in just a moment to wrap this one up as the Tribunes win three to two. Right. The final wrap up here, the final word on this one. With the new tri Tribunes, three runs on seven hits, no errors. Five times they were struck out. They were walked three times. Nutra left six on base and four stolen bases. That's 12 in the last two games for the Trevians. For the Glenbrook South Titans, two runs, five hits, one error. They were struck out four, four times by Paul Duncan. He walked two. The Titans left five on base and one stolen base. So this is Mark Brown. I hope you enjoyed this broadcast. Stick around for more Nutrier Baseball here on the Education Channel and for all of us here in the network. Hope you enjoyed this one, and we say as always, so long.